Aquarius, this is Jackie Tomlin. This is your general reading for the week of March 16, 2020. Thank you guys for stopping by. Happy St. Patty's Day, everyone. Also, this Saturday on the 21st, I am offering a tarot card workshop via Skype. And the links to those, as well as psychic readings, are below this video. If you guys are enjoying these videos, please take the time to like, share, and subscribe. If you're seeking a psychic reading, you'll find the link in the description box, as well as you can contact me at JackieDiamond.com. Aquarius, a lot going on. There's new money coming in. It's telling you to hold on to your goals. Someone is kind of cracking on your low self-esteem. So kind of steer clear of that. You're under era of new beginnings. I also want to remind that that new beginning is in spring and that is March 19th of this week. Okay. Good business deals at hand. I do see you working and gaining um, some secrets being revealed. You're letting go of negative thoughts. Whatever secret is being revealed has you very happy. And it does look like it's you're starting to make plans for your summer, perhaps travel or just plans in general. So let's take a look. This is for Aquarius for your week of March 16, 2020. So Aquarius, we start with the King of Pentacles, followed by the Ten of Pentacles, the King of Wands, Major Arcana of the Death card, the Eight of Wands, and the Knight of Pentacles. A lot of energy going on there. So let's break this down. I'll pull you three more. Starting with the King of Pentacles, I want to throw out that you've got a couple people here uh, looking at a Gemini and an Aries. Okay, it may re resonate with you. First of all, this is the card of financial security, financial independence. And right beside that, we have the Ten of Pentacles. Uh, this is that working and gaining and the new money coming in. This is also the highest financial card in the tarot deck. Things going really strong financially. King of Wands, taking authority, putting your foot down, kind of voicing your opinion. Aquarius, you usually don't do this, but this is, you know, you saying we're going to do A, B, and C instead of X, Y, and Z. You're calling the shots this week. Moving forward, guys, we have the death card. Now, the death card is the closure and endings of one emotional cycle with a rebirth and new beginning in another emotional cycle. So it's going to be what? It's going to be emotional. It's the time frame that you're in. It will be brief and passing, but I also find this to be very high vibration this go around, okay? With that, we have the Eight of Wands. And Eight of Wands just means happiness, total success, and complete happiness. This could also, with my singles out there, this resonates as those love arrows flying as well. Knight of Pentacles also coming in as a good business deal being presented. Uh, another offer of money. Like I said, for whatever reason, I do see you guys are working and gaining towards something. Moving forward, you have the Four of Swords. You have a major kind of strength. You have a major kind of empress. And we have the Three of Cups. Four Swords telling you get the rest that you need when you need it. And I say this because you're going to be busy. That there with your Strength card. Strength is coming in just for the fact that you are going, looking at a busy week. The Empress is the Mother card. Things going well at home. This could also indicate significant changes at home as well as for a small percentage of you. This could indicate news of a pregnancy as well. And then we have that Three of Cups celebration there's good news coming in uh good news when you least expect it like i said negative thoughts fear and worries leaving good news arrives so and like i said this could also well be the planning of a summer vacation so let's take a look here it's what you've i mean aquarius what you've got going on here you've got the death card endings new beginnings coming in, in a very powerful way you have strength just because this is going to be an incredible busy week and we have the Empress, which is the home card, positive changes on the home. This could also be secrets being revealed. So thank you guys for watching. Please take the time to like, share, and subscribe. Don't forget to check out your daily videos as well as your weekend videos. And I will see you guys soon. Bye.